Hi there. Thank you for joining me again on our reading lesson program. I call it reading with Miss Gina because I am Miss Gina. And hopefully I'm going to help you learn some ways that you can read anything you want for the rest of your life. Yeah, really. It first starts with knowing your sounds, which hopefully you've learned some either with me or somebody else. Um, and now what we're going to do is we're going to take sounds that you know, and we're going to put them together. And so, for example, if I said to you, bye, you might be a little confused. Of like, what? I think she's trying to say hi to me, but I'm not sure, right? So when we talk, we put all these sounds that we know together, right? We put them together so that we can let other people know what we mean. And when we write things down, like what you see on the page there, um, that's to tell people what we're trying to sound out. Um, so in this lesson, what I want you to practice is putting those two sounds together. And I'm going to go through it with you. But think of it for a second. If I said I instead of hi, it would be a little confusing for you, right? So this is going to help you start practicing how to join those two things together. Hi, hi. Okay. A lot of times I'm going to be looking down because I have to do the computer and I'm using a pen here to point and click the button for the next page. Okay. But I'll be with you. All right. So the first things I want you to take a look at are, uh, let me get a pointer here for you. I'm sorry for the delay. Here we go. I'm just going to be a spotlight. So I'm going to say the sounds and then I'm going to have you say them with me. Okay, here we go. So we got ah, ah, eh, uh, and it. Now you say them, please. Yeah, very good. If you didn't remember them, that's okay. Just go ahead and look again. You're just learning, right? You can't remember everything all at once, no matter how good a memory we have. Okay, so the other sounds are t, m, n. Let me go back here on these two. So the m is kind of like, m, that was good. Closing your mouth, m. And then this one for nest or no is going to be more like you put. So pretend my thumb is your tongue, right? So your tongue could go up, up there. N, no, or nest. Okay. All right. So the next one we have is f, s, and. Okay. So your turn. We have turtle. Monkey, nest, fish, sun, pear. All right, awesome. We have. You look like like I have gopher teeth, but you have to have that because you have to cover your lips just slightly okay it's not where your teeth you stretch out your mouth and you go and your tongue's inside is where you got to close your mouth a little and let those rabbit teeth show okay all right it's kind of like the word fun it's fun to save all right so we're going to hold on to the f until we get to the a ah. Bath. Ooh, that's kind of fun. Look, it kind of blends together. But I'm going to take that circle off. We're going to start with, we're going to hold it till we get to the sound it's going to. So it's going to connect with its friend, ah, and go fa. Now it's going to connect with its friend, uh, and go fa. Fi. Another friend, fa. Fa. Okay. And because we want them to be a little more close, we're going to do it again. Fa, fa, fi, fa, fe. Yay. 
Uh, I didn't hear any words in that. So we're just going to move on to the blue box. And we're going to start with a ah, and go to the friend. Ready? Ah, uh, if, oh, there's a word, if, like, I wonder if, if. I wonder if. We're going to start with ah. Ready? Off and F. And these we're going to do one more time. We're going to go real slow. Well, we're going to go fast. -er, okay. Don't get worried that I'm going to, we're going to race. We're not going to race right now. Ready? In the blue box, starting with A. Ah. Af. Uff. If. Off. F. All right. Well, okay. Well, thank you so much for joining me. And I will see you in the next lesson which is when we start actually finding words from those combinations right there. We're going to learn am, it, us, and a few more. See you soon.